So even with video Wayne, Wayne ain't heard of me before I hit him up. He was like, man, he like, why I didn't hear you? Why you why other people ain't cover you? I had to tell them. It don't benefit them. <laughs> <laughs> Damn now, nah, that's real though, shit. Damn. Now shit, if you had to uh overall rate your boss talk interview, what would you rate? What you mean though? What I'm rating? I'm rating me, I'm rating them. You rating me up? You rating the interviews a, a total as a whole? Cause like I ain't gonna lie, I tap in, but you know I, I'm tapping into like if I'm interested in the person, I'm gonna watch it. If I know the person, I'm gonna watch it. Or if it's just like some clickbaited ass title, I'm gonna watch it. Like I, I gave a good interview. Hmm. I feel like um as far as like the way they put it out there, they put it out there to get views. Which was this, like that's what they did for, and that's what they did. I mean, that's what, I mean, we all want some views, bro. I ain't gonna lie. And they got them. <laughs> yeah. Bro, I ain't gonna lie. When I get interviewed, I already be thinking this ain't finna get no views. So when somebody put an interview out on me and they do something, I be like, you, you slick. Like, yeah. but the only time my interview ever did something, you know, it was Please, like man. that, yeah. For sure, for sure. Now, you did speak on your cousin mystical as well, you know what I'm saying? I know it's a very touchy subject. Yeah. Like, uh, same with that, bro. Like, if you if you gonna, I'm, I could talk about my cousin's situation, but if we gonna talk about it, put everything I said in how I said it. All right. I'm gonna chop it up and make it. So, okay, like, what did you like about how it chopped up? Cause, bro, like, I was really taking up with my cousin, and they were basically saying, like, rape ain't no, um, Rape ain't nothing to play with. And I'm like, if he really raped somebody, throw him in a jail. But I know he ain't do that. Right. They took that apart. Like, if he really raped somebody, throw him in a jail and, and put it out like that. And it's like, you know, a couple of people hollered at me about that. And I'm like, man, first of all, don't ask me nothing about nothing. But at the same time, the rest gonna come out. I hope it do. But bro, don't get at me like that, bro. I ain't, yeah. I ain't like that. You feel like it, uh, it, uh, I know that's family, you know what I'm saying? Like, so did, did your family look at you a certain type of way after that? Nah, nah, I don't know. My family, baby. I don't care about all that. Dude, like I said, it's the internet world, bro. Like, a lot of people separate the internet from real life. So even those, anybody I probably spoke on in those interviews, ain't none of them had no problem with it. And they they could listen to me and be like, man, nigga trying to cross fresh up. You could read the comments, they like, man, they trying to cross fresh up. They trying to cross fresh up. Like, bro, I ain't say nothing wrong, bro. If, if you feel like I said something wrong, or if you feel like I did something wrong, you got crossed up. Yeah, nah, fact. Okay, for sure, for sure. Now, shit, uh, I did watch the interview and you revealed something I think a lot of people didn't know or didn't catch on. Mm -hmm. That they were saying, uh, the woman who was allegedly, you know, raped, what, that's actually your cousin's mom. Mm -hmm. Like, I don't know that, like, that shit went over a lot of people's head, you know what I'm saying? So, you know what I'm saying? like. Just for the whole allegation, like hot, you know what I'm saying? Like, what's what's Mystical's head at like right now? Have you spoken with him? And I ain't talked to him since he been gone, bro. But right before he left, he told me that um somebody was trying to um frame him. Yeah. So I ain't know who the somebody was. Yeah. But damn, you feel like uh hot, like. Money and fame, bro, like, how do you feel like that affects people? Like, because a lot of people, like, you know, we, we one of the first blogs to post it as well, you know what I'm saying? Like, it was breaking news, it went everywhere, but I will say we did also make sure we posted when the, the, when the charges was got clear, yeah. Right. That's another thing I was talking about, too. Like, a lot of people quick to break the news, then when he get, you know, on some innocent stuff, they ain't break that. So then when he get charged again, it's like, dang, again? It's like, bro, y'all gonna count that last time when they was completely lying? I feel like a lot of people be saying, though, for you, you need to be in a situation three times, it's kind of like, you know what I'm saying, double jeopardy. But at the same time, or triple jeopardy, I don't know. But at the same time, like, a lot of people have never been to Louisiana. A I was lot just going to say, ain't been in the people system. from Louisiana, like, really engaged with people, like. People ain't never been in the system before, bro, because once you, once you get in that one time, you be in there. And that's just what that is. Like, and it ain't got nothing to do with rape, it ain't got nothing to do with Louisiana. It's like once you get once you get caught slipping that first time, it seemed like if you in the streets or if you live in a certain way, you not finna get away from that. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? 
even when we talk about his situation, because that's not no street so that's not nothing like that. But even like, you could get caught having sex in the car, bro, yeah. and get a and get a sex offender charge, yeah. and now for the rest of your life, people looking at you like a sex offender. You got to register as a sex offender. That counts the first time. So it's like, bro, bro. That's a serious thing for me, cause you know I, I feel for my women that really go through that. But then it's like it's a scam world, bro. It's a lot of scamming going on, you know. So, so, so shit. Uh, if you had to say like, you know, the the percentage of him being these targets, what would you say you had with it right now? Bro, to be honest with you, I honestly don't know, because I feel like he been railroaded. And just like how you say, you ain't supposed to get caught up in those situations. So I just feel like he got caught slipping and, 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 and slippers count. Yeah. He ain't like, oh, he got caught slipping, so I ain't gonna get him. You got, you got, got. Right, so, so, you, you talk to your cousin and son? Man, bro, the last time I talked to him is when it happened. Yeah. Last time I talked to him when it happened. We cool though, bro. I just, I don't know. I don't know. I probably need to holler at him, but. I know then it wasn't really no time to holler. I just hollered to see if he was straight. You know what I'm saying? He was messed up behind me. And like, we was already in the works of working and doing stuff, but I really ain't heard from him, for real. Yeah, but this is mom and his daddy, bro. Yeah, like, shit, it's fucked up. So I'm saying, this real, this real life you did with me. Like, but this, everybody talk about it online, but this is yeah, like, that's some people going through people this. People living, really living that, like, what? Yeah, like, I feel like the media really don't really be taking that shit into consideration. Like, they just after the story, like, yeah, it's a viral story, but it's somebody out here that's living that story that got to deal with this day-to-day. -day, you know for what I'm sure, saying? For like, sure. Like, for sure, crazy. for sure. And I love my cousin today. I wanted to work with my dog so bad, bro, but not, like, I be on some of these what it is. I been chalked up that feature, but even before all this, I yeah. chalked up the feature. I was still hanging with him when I chalked up the feature, but it just be like how stuff play out, like, I look at that like life, man. and a lot of people disagree, but it's like, man, every, you know how stuff be too good to be true? Yeah. So like, I got a famous cousin, he on top of the world, he on top of the game, he was literally the hottest rapper at one point, yeah. and it's like, this was when I wasn't doing music. By the time I started doing music, he had already went through it the first time, going through it the second time, now it's the third time. But it's like, it was just too good to be true to have a famous cousin that was finna put me on or something. That was never finna happen. Yeah. It was like, I better be lucky I had a famous cousin. Like, it's yeah. just life, bro. Yeah. Nah, shit is crazy. It is life, though.